As my viewers and subscribers may remember, I gave you an update on the Royal Rumble a few days ago about how the winner would be somebody that would be shocking, somebody that you would not suspect. Well, I got major developments on that right now, huge developments on the Royal Rumble, and huge updates as it concerns WrestleMania's main event. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the iconic Show and View Entertainment. Make sure to click the bell below for the flow of Show and View Entertainment and hit that subscribe button to get all the uploads, updates right here on the Brash Show and View Entertainment. Make sure to share, subscribe, and like today. And please check out the four videos previous to this one. And the seven subscriber shout out will be coming. I know I promised it in the next upload, but this uh, update was so significant, I had to get it out and I had to bring it to you. Because here on Show and View, I don't just give you the news and the rumors in WWE, I give you the changes, the developments, and the advancements. But the seven shout-outs for the YouTube subscribers will be coming for you as long as you comment, hit the bell below, subscribe, and like. There was rumors that the winner of the Royal Rumble match in 2017 on the WWE Network would not be somebody you would expect. And it would actually be somebody that would win it for the first time ever. Well, in a major turn of events, a major development to the Royal Rumble story, and something that would sit well with many WWE fans just because of how this superstar is so good at what he does and draws you in and has evolved on every level on Monday Night Raw. Some say he has been one of the most consistent stars in Raw history. There is now rumors with Chris Jericho being involved in the ongoing storyline where he and WWE Universal Champion Kevin Owens are best friends. The two even pulled an elaborate ruse on the fans on last Monday's episode of Raw, pretending to blame one another for Team Raw's loss at Survivor Series. Instead, they both looked at each other and blurted out Roman Reigns as the one who cost them the match. Ironically, Owens will be defending the WWE Universal Championship at the upcoming Roadblock pay-per-view against Roman Reigns. Should Kevin Owens win that match, it's rumored he'll continue past the Royal Rumble as the WWE Universal Champion on the red brand. The storyline with he and Jericho as good friends, but Owens often winning with Jericho's help, which has been a constant, but not always helping out Jericho, and Jericho always getting hurt, injured, losing, you know, getting caught off guard. Kevin Owens definitely has not been a good crowd pleaser and a, and a good friend, uh, as we all think he has. And it, it would cause an immediate rift between the two friends as tensions build towards a huge match at WrestleMania 33, where Jericho would end up winning the Royal Rumble 2017 match. It certainly makes sense as the future Hall of Famer, Chris Jericho, has never won the Royal Rumble match during his WWE career. And ladies and gentlemen, this is absolutely an enormous update. I guaranteed you, I said to you, I laid it down to you a few days ago. And that is why it is crucial to subscribe and comment and watch my videos and click the bell below for all the updates. Because remember I said to you, I was, I was having my sources look into who this unlikely superstar to win the Rumble would be. Because, I mean, yeah, Jericho's been a staple in the Royal Rumble. Jericho's returned at the Royal Rumble. But Jericho has never won the Royal Rumble. Jericho is not someone you would expect to win the Royal Rumble. And now here is the update to that development. Chris Jericho winning the 2017 Royal Rumble. Then going on to headline the main event against Kevin Owens at WrestleMania. However, if the WWE does decide to change plans, if they do which is not likely at this point because we know the WWE can, you know, hit that reset button. Finn Balor could end up winning, and it could be Finn Balor versus Chris Jericho versus Kevin Owens in a triple threat match. Rumors of Owens versus Balor has also been brought up, but the powers that be don't believe that to be a huge enough match for WrestleMania. But since Owens and Jericho has been a constant storyline and constant conflict, well, then that would walk the line and make set the stage for WrestleMania. Jericho wins the Rumble, goes on to face Kevin Owens, universal title match, and I'll tell you what, it would blow the roof off and it would catapult Chris Jericho to perhaps his final run in WWE. Your comments, your opinions, subscribe today for the premier sauce for all things WWE, your one-stop destination. Please go check out the four videos previous to this one just in case you missed them because I know YouTube's algorithm is all effed up. Subscribe. And do you think Chris Jericho is deserving enough to win the Royal Rumble? Hey, listen, Jericho came up with the concept of the Money in the Bank ladder match. He's been in the Money in the Bank ladder match. He's never won his own concept. It's about time another Attitude Era favorite wins 
the Royal Rumble match. The Undertaker has won it. Austin has won it. Triple H has won it. The Rock has won it. It's, it's now time for Chris Jericho to win it all. Subscribe.